All right, hockey season is in full swing, and when the temperatures <laughs> drop, the skates are getting laced up. You can eat your skates and your soup. Yep. Hockey Day Minnesota <laughs> back in the Metro this year. It's in White Bear Lake. Hannah Flood has been hanging out there all morning, checking things out before the puck drops. How's it going out there? Good morning. It's definitely a soup day out here. Yep. It actually feels pretty comfortable. We had a lot of snow this morning. You can see a lot of dusting. But hey, they got the rink cleared off. We have White Bear Lake girls hockey out there practicing right now. They have a big game coming up tomorrow. All of the high school teams that are playing this weekend, they get a chance to get out here and practice. Get, get the feel of it. You know, it is a different vibe playing hockey outside the way nature, the way it was intended to play. That's what they say, right? I'm here with, feels like Mr. Hockey Day himself, Kevin Gorg. Thanks for joining us. Big week, big yep. weekend out here. Uh, tell me, what are you most looking forward to for Hockey Day this year? Just to see the way White Bear embraces it. Every year it gets bigger, it gets better, and the city, you know, there's hundreds of people that kind of put this thing on as volunteers, and how will White Bear handle it? We know how well Mankato did last year, and so now they'll try to you know raise the bar one more notch. Yeah. Show us, point to Strom here, our photographer, where you are during the game. So We're right up Valley top Sports there in North. that cozy, warm booth. So well, it can be you. single digits out here, <laughs> but it's going to be at least 60, 65 degrees in there. It's going to feel like spring break. You know, Lapanta's here. We can't mess that up. So <laughs> we got to keep him warm and cozy. Well, hockey hair, it's an important combination. Hockey hair and soup. It was. Oh, you poor thing. I'm sorry. You're a good sport. You're a good sport. I try. Uh, tomorrow's kind of a marathon for you guys on the broadcast side for Bally Sports North. You were telling me earlier, you're pretty much live out here for games all day. All day, yeah. It, three outdoor games here and, of course, the wild game in St. Paul. So we're on the air on Bally Sports North from 9 a.m. till roughly midnight, and we love it. It's the one day where every single person over at our station has their fingerprints on this day. We build this for months and so we're all really pumped about it, and I think it's going to be magical. We have another photographer over in kind of the uh, village, yeah. we'll call it the hangout village. This has expanded so much beyond hockey. It Tell has. me what else is out here. Well, it's become a weekend celebration. So, yes, the games and the outdoor rink are the center stage, so to speak, but there's food trucks, there's cozy places to warm up, there's fire pits, there's music, there's jumbotrons where you can watch these games or the wild game. So it really is a big party. So if people haven't been to a hockey day and you're local, get out to White Bear Lake tomorrow. You'll really enjoy it. We've got uh St. John's versus Augsburg. That's yes. kind of new, a Division Three hockey game uh, involved in Hockey Day weekend festivities. We've got live bands out here. What is your favorite part? My favorite part is when the sun finally goes down, right? And I think you'll see the biggest crowd here tomorrow because it's boys hockey. It's Hill Murray, White Bear Lake, probably the one of the greatest rivalries in high school hockey. And now everybody has put the work in. They've been building, and now here is... The, the kind of the pinnacle of the outdoor event. And then you get to watch these two longtime rivals kind of go toe to toe. To me, it's it's the best part every year when the host team finally takes the ice and, and the city's so proud and they're like, there's our boys. Yeah. That's when it kind of comes to a crescendo and I can't wait to see how it plays out. Excellent, all right, well, it kind of kicks off tonight with games, then the big games tomorrow. Uh, so head down to White Bear Lake to check it out. We're gonna drop the gloves now. Let's go, let's get after the it. The wild got four times last night. You gotta get that jersey up over there. You gotta get the haymaker. That's how you do hockey fights. Let's go. Uh, I'm out of here. <laughs> she can do it. Can we can go back to I love that. hockey fighting. That was good. Nice job, Hannah. Oh, wow, my. She just got I appreciate completely that. beat up all She her. did. She, she obviously doesn't have <laughs> an older brother. Really good. She's got a younger wow. brother, though. Okay, that was fun. <laughs>